Hi, today we will make a timer switch. We can set time. For example, I set 30 minutes in timer switch. That means after 30 minutes it will turn off automatically. So let's build it. For that you require 8 mega 8 rotary encoder, 4 digit 7 segment display and relay or relay board and some other components. Now let us solder all the components according to diagram. You will find diagram link as always in description. You will also find code link in description. Here I use 8 mega 8. You can also use 8 mega 32 8 p or Arduino Uno or Nano or Pro Mini. If you are using 8 mega 8 or 8 mega 32 8 p then first you have to burn bootloader. Then use FTDI32 to upload the code to chip. You can set up to 99 minutes of time. You can use this with any appliances. For example, you can use mobile charger or water pump or battery charger or any other appliances. Set the time and it will automatically turn off the load. As you can see soldering work is done. I will cut unused remaining PCB so it will occupy less space. Now for powering this I will use 5 volt SMPS. Now it is time to make case for it. I will use 4 by 4 by 2 inch project box. I marked all the dimension then cut it then fix everything in it. Before fixing in everything in this box, first you check everything is working correctly or not.
here I will remove unused copper pads so there will be more insulation. After securing everything, close the box. Secure everything so there will be no short circuit after close the box. And after 5 hours of working, it is finally done. Now let us test it. Plug the pin in AC socket and switch on. For testing, as a load, I will use mobile charger. You can use any appliances, just plug in this socket. Now set the time using rotary encoder. Here just for demo I will use 20 seconds. After set the time press the button. As you can see charger is turned on. And also countdown is started. As you can see after 20 minutes it's turned off the load and making sound. You can set up to 99 minutes. That red push button is for reset. Suppose you want to pause the timer then press the button one time. After that, once again you press the button, it will continue the timer. Now, if you want to stop the timer, then press the button two time. If you don't get any point, feel free to comment it. I hope you like this project. If so, like, share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.